Hello, everyone. My name is Vicky Tsianika, and I am the product manager of MSC Nation. I would like to welcome you to the presentation of what's new in MSC Nation for version 2023.4. In this release, we're introducing a range of exciting features and enhancements. So, without any delay, let's dive straight into the details. We're all familiar with MSC Nashran, a software known for its distinctive capabilities that have shaped it into the powerful tool that it is today. Users have access to a diverse array of capabilities spanning from linear statics and dynamics to nonlinear analysis, rotor dynamics, error elasticity, optimization, and DMOP programming. Additionally, MSC National boasts some distinctive features such as MSC National Poro Elastic Analysis and Modules alongside embedded fatigue. As the first software and gold standard since the late 1960s, its enduring commitment to innovation makes MSC National the benchmark for reliability and excellence. With decades of experience, MSC National stands as the trusted solution in the industry. By seamlessly integrating cutting-edge capability, the software not only meets but exceeds uh, user expectations, ensuring that your simulations are not just accurate but also feature-proof. When you choose MSC National, you embrace a legacy of precision, innovation and trust that fuels the success of your engineering endeavors. Let's look at the new capabilities and updates of MSC National 2023.4. In a nutshell, the latest release promises an array of enhancements from elevated linear dynamics to advancements in rotor dynamics, optimization, and error elasticity, all of course powered by unparalleled performance. Let's just now dive into the specifics, beginning with the excitement developments that we have in linear dynamics. In this latest release, we're introducing an innovative method called the knocked down method, which is a new body in white approach for acoustic coupling. With this method, we significantly reduce the influence of unwanted fluid uh, grids on the results, mimicking the effect of their actual removal. The automatic tuning of AC model parameters associated with this method enhances the accuracy of fluid structure interface results when applied alongside other AC model parameters. The user interface, as you see over here, is simple. The user can input it directly on the AC model entry with method field set to BWKD. If the user wishes to have the method set as default, it can also be set in mscnations.rc file. In MSC Nation 2022.4, we introduced a statistical energy analysis approach, which is called Virtual SEA. This approach is based on finite element models from which all necessary information is extracted. It allows extending the frequency range of validity of these finite element models. There are various benefits for adopting a Virtual SEA approach. By leveraging a low-frequency finite element model, this methodology proves highly effective in conducting simulation analysis across mid- and high frequencies. The process is further elevated by the unmatched performance of HPC in MSC Nashron, ensuring a seamless and efficient simulation experience. In this release, the fluid subsystems are included in the virtual SEA system in order to incorporate fluid structure coupling for enhanced accuracy. In the field of dynamics, we have also introduced a physical approach to 1D trim in MSC National Pore Elastic Material Analysis, or the well-known PEM analysis. The definition of a 1D analytical trim becomes more straightforward with the inclusion of layer properties such as thicknesses and materials. This eliminates the necessity for repeated meshing when there are changes in the design. In this version, the model approach is extended to include the physical approach by default. With the physical approach, the user has now the option to recover data on the trim parts, benefiting simultaneously by improved performance. As shown here, the user interface is straightforward. Only one parameter is needed in order to activate this functionality. 
Finally, in our latest release, we have introduced a more user-friendly interface for defining the diffuse sound field in MSC Nation. Since MSC Nation 2021.2, the MSC Nation Act and Co-Simulation tool managed by the Workflow Manager for Space has enabled the study of structures under diffuse sound field excitation. The Workflow Manager for Space automates the coupling of MSC Nation and ACTA computations, efficiently managing inputs and outputs. Now, in this 2023.4 release, we further streamlined this process by allowing users to easily define the excitation directly within the MSC Nation input file. These enhancements not only improve the user interface, but also facilitate the use of a single input file for Workflow Manager for Space, enhancing the overall workflow efficiency. Again, the user interface is rather simple. The whole actor and excitation can now be defined within MSC National using this bulk uh, data entry, DSF Actron. Moving on to the area of rotor dynamics. In the aerospace industry, solution 128 is commonly employed for windmilling analysis, especially when dealing with multiple nonlinearities, which can be quite challenging. In MSC National 2023.4, we're introducing a new numerical method called QR decomposition to make the rotor dynamic solution more stable and convergent. This means that we are enhancing the stability of any general nonlinear frequency response problem, making it more efficient to address nonlinear dynamic challenges. For more information on this functionality, you can, uh, of course, visit the release notes as well as the quick reference guide of MSC Nastra. Let's move on to the HPC enhancements for MSC Nation 2023.4. In vibra acoustic analysis, particularly using solution 103, 111, or 112, the concept of real coupled modes is inter is, was introduced to enhance accuracy in fluid structure interaction. Previously, the model method only allowed computation of real normal modes for structures without considering fluid dynamics. This limitation was notable when dealing with heavy fluids like liquids, as it didn't accurately uh, capture the fluid structure interaction. The real coupled modes methodology addresses this by introducing an efficient solution strategy. The real coupled modes approach ensures more accurate and uh, more accurate results, making it invaluable for users seeking improved realism in analyzing structures interacting with both light and heavy fluids. In this latest release, remarkable performance enhancements have been achieved, particularly for large-scale problems. The introduction of the new real coupled method translates to an unprecedented speed boost, with, with runs now operating at least five times faster. Simultaneously, the method automatically addresses singularity issues, ensuring smoother and more reliable outcomes in your simulation. To benefit from the latest, uh, from this latest improvement, the user simply needs to activate the method. Same uh, Furthermore, in this release, we're rolling out a major upgrade: the integration of the MAMSA solver in our launcher's Agile solver. This development demonstrates unparalleled speed, speed improvements since MAMSA is a state-of-the-art, highly scalable solution. It is applicable across all solution sequences using the real launcher's Eigen solver, and the MAMPS integration in MSC Nation significantly accelerates various solution processes. Activating MAMPS is user friendly. We just have to utilize the sparse solver executive keyword as demonstrated here. Furthermore, in today's complex model, in industries like aerospace and automotive, the RBE three elements with numerous connected grids are commonplace. However, the numerical processing of these RBE elements, particularly during constraint elimination, can be very time consuming without significantly enhancing the quality of the results. This new capability called automatic RBE three leg trimming is designed to streamline the simulation process in MSC Nastran by reducing the connected grids of the RBE3 
aiming to significantly expedite simulations across all NAS transolution sequences that support RB3 elements. Of course, the user will experience significantly reduced runtimes while maintaining the analysis accuracy. The new capability can be activated via FEM check within MSC NASRAN. In the context of in the context of arguments, this release brings an automated correction for additional degrees of freedom, addressing potential numerical singular singularities that could otherwise result in simulation errors. This new capability automatically automatically rectifies modeling errors introducing, introduced during the modeling process. By ensuring that the reference grid has rotational components enabled, it facilitates moment transfer to underlying independent grids with rotational degrees of freedom, thus enhancing the accuracy and stability of the simulations. Finally, we're introducing significant performance enhancements in our fast eigenvalue solver called ACMS. ACMS stands for Automated Component Model, model uh, Synthesis, and this is an embedded feature in MSC uh, NASH. And it is designed to boost productivity by accelerating your simulations. The introduction of the grid compression method results in an impressive 30% speed up when utilizing 16 cores. The user interface is straightforward and no additional user action is required in order to benefit from this new HPC improvement. The user simply has to use domain solver ACMS to take advantage of these latest improvements. In this slide, we're reviewing some of the key changes implemented in the previous releases to provide a comprehensive overview of the HPC enhancements. Our Solve Equals Auto initiative streamlines the MSC National HPC settings by automating the tuning process to spare users from manual parameter adjustments. This feature intelligently selects the optimal solver, parallel settings, memory allocation, and BPO configurations. In the latest release, we have introduced the flexibility for users to enable or disable ACMS, allowing them to choose between launchers and ACMS. A noteworthy addition is the no run option, which provides users with optimized HPC settings without executing the job. This empowers users to quickly assess the ideal settings for their model and make the informed decisions for a later analysis. For example, how much memory does this model need in order to run? You can obtain this result without having to run the actual job. Furthermore, we have made significant usability enhancements by adjusting the MSC national defaults. Buff size has been increased to enhance IO performance and people is now set automatically when users set specific memory for the run, ensuring more efficient and faster IO operations. These changes collectively contribute to a smoother and more user-friendly experience. In the area of optimization, we extended the DR span functionality to allow the designation of DRESP to responses at the subcase level. In MSC National, sometimes you want to combine results from different scenarios. For example, you might want to restrict the average displacement across various cases. This constraint applies to an overall value, so you can use the design global command at the broader subcase level. To specify which responses from individual subcases should be part of this overall response, you use the DR span command. It helps identify and include the specific subcase responses needed for the overarching response, making it handy when you want to analyze or constrain results across different situations. With this new enhancement, the user can synthesize responses from subcase dependent responses above the subcase level, providing a more comprehensive and versatile approach uh, for DRESP2 responses. A typical benefit is to be able to sum RMS responses that were formulated based on a number of frequency dependent DRESP ones at the subcase level to a global response above the subcase level. Of course, the new enhancement can be extended to a plethora of other applications as well. 
In the area of air elasticity, static air elastic improvements have been made. Specifically, data blocks have been introduced in the air elastic database to support analysis involving gravity and applied loads in subsequent runs. Additionally, the monitor point 3 output has been enhanced to match the format of the monitor point 1 output. The benefit of these changes are twofold. Firstly, the added data blocks prevent a fatal error when loads are added to a follow-up analysis. Secondly, in early releases, the monitor point 3 output had a single misleading column. In the 2023-4 release, it now presents a comprehensive presents comprehensive columns, aligning it with the monitor point one output and providing more accurate and useful information for analysis. For user subroutines, um, we have made the following enhancements. User subroutines empower users to import material and element properties effortlessly. In this latest release, the software has undergone substantial improvements for user convenience. Now users can seamlessly integrate their subroutines with the solver, requiring only a compatible compiler, eliminating the need for any additional SDK toolkit. This enhancement is geared towards enhancing system usability and efficiency for our users. As usual, we have addressed numerous issues in MSC Nation to ensure a more robust performance. For a detailed overview, you can refer to our companion website. It's worth noting that MSC National now utilizes the latest version of the MAMS solver, version 5.6.1. While GPU support for MAMS was temporarily disabled in MSC National 2023.3, it has been re-enabled in this release. Additionally, as part of our efforts to streamline the program and simplify maintenance, certain obsolete capabilities have been removed. This slide is the key highlights from our previous releases. Notable improvements on and reduced memory requirements for ACMS. Beyond this, there is a range of capabilities for the user to explore. A particular safe displacement output providing NVH analysts the ability to extract ODS responses effort effortlessly without the need for dummy subcases or extra steps. For complete automations, we can identify response peaks using peak out in MSC National and then seamlessly extract ODSs with ACMS, solidifying MSC National analysis in the market. And finally, this is an overview slide of the latest release that we just discussed, encompassing a summary of all the discussed functionalities. For more support and resources, feel free to explore our SIM Companion website. It serves as a comprehensive hub for all things for MSC National, offering access to documentation, user forums, discussions, and webinars to enhance your expertise. If you need immediate assistance, our frontline support is just an email away. For licensing inquiries, you can find the relevant contact information here. For any inquiries related to MSC Nashram, feel free to reach out to either me, Vicky, the product manager of MSC Nashram, or Herman Patel, the head of development for MSC Nashram. Thank you for your attention, and we hope you enjoy exploring the brand new features of MSC National for 2023.4 release.